This was just for me to take a drink. Should we spin this? Yeah! I like how everyone like behind the first one's like yes, and the first one's like oh no. Yes, we will spin the water. I know! It's not like the last part didn't work or anything. You ready? Are you sure? You see, the thing is, is everyone's, I always ask if you're ready, but no one ever asks. Uh, no, we're good, okay. I'm ready. Are we sure? Okay. I'm just making sure we're still all on the same page. Okay. Who thinks disaster is about to happen? Who thinks I'm gonna have to call housekeeping to help me out here? <laughs> Who thinks? No, you plan the show, it's one thing's gonna work. And who's like, one thing has already worked, therefore, it's gonna be a disaster. Okay, two things are not allowed to work in this show, we've already done one. Disaster begins in... I guess, ah! Ah! How do I stop? All right. That was pretty cool. But it also works for water. Water spins around, and when it goes up here, it's hanging upside down. The water quickly will fall out of it, but then it'll catch it and not fall all the way. Anyways, should we do another demonstration? Okay, not the chicken yet. You see, everyone's always like, do the chicken thing. And then I say it until the end, that's why I have people the whole way through. I have a demonstration which has not worked in a very long time. And I'm feeling up to it. Should I show you the demonstration? Okay. I don't know when it's going to arrive. So when you see it work, you have to yell, wow, very loud. Okay. If I say, is it working, and nothing's happened, you gotta go, we got a problem, okay? Is it working? Oh, it's supposed to appear right there. Is it working? Huh. Is it working? Yeah! What's happening? Yeah! I'm being blocked by a door. Oh, oh, these. Make sure you stay inside of the red zone, my friend. You gotta go where the floor is green. Okay. Huh. I guess this is an object, isn't it? It's a bunch of bowling balls. Who has never seen this thing work before? Yeah, me neither. We're gonna figure it out together. Ha! Huh. We got five bowling balls. I don't know what to do with them. Wow, more people showed up, this is awkward. Well, we're gonna test the law. Newton's third law for every action is an equal and opposite reaction. So I'm gonna take this from here and I let go. What do we think is gonna happen? How many people think stuff might happen? How many people think the universe will implode? Okay. How many people think? Two things have worked. It's impossible to have three things work in this show. Also true. Here we go. Are you ready? We're gonna say three, two, one, let go. Isn't that so satisfying? But wait, there's more. What if I take two? How do you all think? People are saying two is gonna happen. Let's see if you're right. Ready? Three. Wow. 
for every action, this, there's an equal opposite reaction. This, action, reaction. Action, reaction. Okay. Now this is where it gets complicated. What if I take three? You see, if you divide five by two, you get two and a half. And I think I'll get in trouble if I cut this one in half because it finally works. I take three. Think about what you think is going to happen. Tell it to your neighbor. Ready? Ready? My arms are getting sore. I'm waiting on you. Now we're transferring momentum. We have momentum going this way. And to even out the momentum, our third ball transfer sides. But now, what should we try now? Four. That would make sense. He's done one, he did two, and then he did three. We're gonna stop at three. No, we're gonna do four. Of course we're doing four. This is the locomotion show. Ready? To even out the momentum, now three balls have to come over. That's pretty cool. But now, we've tried one, tried two, tried three, we tried four. Now what should we try? This is my favorite one. We're going to do all five. Are we ready? Wow, it's five. Mind-blowing experience. Okay. Now, on a serious note, I'm going to make these go back up. If it doesn't work, you better yell, uh-oh, we got a problem, because uh-oh, we'll have a problem. Ready? 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 Stop moving! Ah! Man. Now, who thought that was pretty cool? Who thinks we're not at the amount of ridiculousness yet? Okay, me too. I'm gonna try something before the chicken that I've never done before. And this is either gonna be the coolest thing I have ever done in my history of shows at Science World, or it's gonna be a huge mess. Either way, it's a win-win for you people. The common thing is what came first, the chicken or the egg, correct? Well, in this demonstration, the egg's gonna come before the chicken. Because, where is it? I have a glass of water. Is that exciting? Maybe if I spin it again, it's exciting, but other than that, not really. Okay, cup of water. I got a pan. Okay, who's very confused? Who thinks this has turned into a cooking show very quickly? Yes. But just wait. PVC tube. I know, now everyone's like, what is happening? Making sure it's even. Okay. You see, now we have that. Ping pong ball or egg? Good answer. I have an egg. We're going to take the egg, we're going to put it on the PVC pipe. And now, we're going to salute the mighty egg. Now, I have a broom. I'm just going to knock it out. We're just going to go right here. We're going three, two, one, let go. And hopefully, the egg goes where? Into the water. What do we think is actually going to happen? Everything else except what is supposed to happen. Because fun fact, when they trained me on this show two years ago, guess how many times I got this right? Zero, yeah. Guess how many times I tried it? 54. So, who thinks today is the day Number 55 is gonna work. Who thinks 
Why are you putting this in a show with a live audience? What is wrong with me? I know. Okay. We're gonna be like we're golfing, we're lining up the putts. Okay. Here we go. I need a moment to decompress. If you have a slow motion camera and you either want a sweet video or watching a grown man get giddy over getting an egg into a cup, today is your lucky day. Are we ready? No one ever asked me if I'm ready. Yes. And now, we're gonna drink it like Rocky. No, I'm kidding, that's gross. What should I do as my last demonstration? The chicken, okay. Only because you asked so many times. So the chicken is cool, the chicken is great, it's a nice time. But, I need a person to help me launch it. And I need the people over on the second floor to catch the chicken and throw it back. But, to help me launch it, they just need to know what 3, 2, 1, let go means because I don't know how to follow instructions. You, my friend, in the striped shirts. Okay. Are you ready? Okay. Hold on to the chicken. <laughs> to help us out, I have this obnoxiously large device. It's a slingshot, yes. Because, what else did you need to throw it? All right, so second floor, I'm watching a chicken at your face. You can catch it with your hands and throw it back, or you can follow the bird pun and duck. One of you laugh, that's good. Okay. But remember, give me back the chicken, or else we'll hunt you down with security cameras. Are you ready? We're gonna take our chicken, and we're gonna fold it in half, because that's how chickens work. No, they don't. This is the last demo of the show. Thank you all for coming. Science so is a non-profit organization. Your mission goes to bring programs like BC Green Games, which help schools all over BC, make their schools more green and sustainable, which is good for everybody. Let's launch a chicken. Hold on to the head and the legs. We're gonna go this way. We're gonna go this way. And then we're gonna go three, two, one, let go. When they say let go, what do we do? We let go. And throw the chicken back. Throw. A round of applause for our volunteer. You can take a seat. That was the welcome.